So we are with Phyllis. She is 62 and she has come all the way from Kenya for a hip replacement. She has pain on left side. On x-ray we could find out there is some problem on right side as well but it is not very painful. So we are planning a hip replacement on left side. So we are starting examination. Okay. Yes. So for how long are you suffering from this pain? I've been suffering for the last two years. Two years. Yeah. And how did it start? You had some injury, some accident, you had a fall. No, I've never had a fall, I've never had an injury. Hmm. It just started, on just started spontaneously. Hmm. If you want to walk, how much distance can you walk in one go? At the moment, the longest I can walk is three kilometers. Three kilometers you can walk? Yes, sir. Without painkiller? Okay, I'll have to take the painkiller after that. If you're, if you're without painkiller, then? Without painkiller. Hmm. Maybe one kilometer. Maybe one kilometer. But you are limping. Yes, I'm limping. And you can f uh, sense that there is slight shortening of the limb on the left side. Can you feel it while walking? Even when standing. Even while standing. Yeah. Okay. So there are two problems that you cannot walk long. Yes. You have to take painkillers frequently. Yes. And there is shortening of the limb. Yes. What are other activities that are hampered by this? Things that you are not able to do now. Like begging for long. Hmm. I can't do, like, let's say like housework. Mm -hmm. I can't for a long time mm -hmm. and um, like squatting not possible okay okay aerobic exercises all right I can't be able to do that mm -hmm. because uh, it's like my legs now have become so close together that I cannot you're not able to open them I can't be able to open yes, them yes 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 those exercises that can mm -hmm. open mm -hmm. yeah I can't all right, all right. Yeah. so basically it's now deteriorating your quality of life Yes, it is. Hmm. Yes. Right. Very much so. Yeah. yeah. Alright, so our plan is that we will be doing hip replacement yes. with MIS technique so that mm -hmm. you are able to do all these activities okay. and you just forget about it after a month. Oh. That there ever, ever any pain or surgery was done on left side. Okay. So that is our mission. Yes. And hopefully we will succeed in it. Yeah, hopefully. Of course, with your cooperation, so that you do physiotherapy exercise, what we tell you yes. after the surgery. Okay? okay. So, we'll just examine how much is the difference, how, how much are the movements. Okay? okay. So, to begin with, yes. uh, the shortening of limb on left side, it is around half an inch. Uh, there is slight difference in thigh muscles on left side. And first, we'll do movements on right side, which is pain-free. So there is good range of movement, rotations are restricted because there is slight involvement on this side also and if uh, we do abduction it is around 20 degree which is less than normal. Normally it should be 40 or 45 degree. It is coming only 20 and if we, if we see the left side which is painful, flexion is reasonably good but rotations are totally gone. There is no movement in the hip. Actually if I am moving it the whole body is moving, the pelvis is moving and if we do abduction it is just 5 degrees and it's painful. Yes it is. Right? Yes. Move your toes. Okay. So there is no neurological deficit, the only problem is in the hip. Okay. Right side. You go to the right. Hmm. Come back once. Come back. Hmm. Again. And see how you can do it. You can take support. You can take support. So whenever she is putting weight on the left side, she has to push more and because it's painful, it's not comfortable even on right side. So it's not smooth. It's, you, are str you are making more efforts. Yes, I do make efforts. Mm. Not, not less. Yes. Like, All right. Like mm -hmm. yes. 
this is the x-ray before surgery and you can see arthritis on left side and some arthritis on right side also but left side is very painful and she is limping for last two and a half years this is the x-ray after surgery and you can see the non-cemented implant nicely snugly fit very solid with mis technique it was 10 days and now she is walking comfortably not so much means what There's is the some discomfort and how much difference before surgery and after surgery oh, there is a difference there is a difference yes there is a difference because you? before surgery hmm. i could not be able to wake up and walk immediately now i can you had to wait i had to wait and then you used to then i start my first step. now you can get up and start walking now i can get up and start walking Okay, so that's there, good. there's a big difference. And are you able to climb stairs? Have you tried it? Yes, I'm trying. I'm trying. Okay. One floor. One floor you can. Yes, one floor I can. Okay. Yes. So can we try it again? Yeah. Great. And can you walk without taking support? Yes, I can, but slowly. Slowly. All, all right. All right. Yes, I can. Yes, please. Yes, yes, yes. Very good. So I think you don't need anything actually. You don't need any support I because don't need any support. Yes. yes. And first you will put this leg. This one. Yeah, this one. The good leg. Good leg first. Good leg first. This is also good otherwise. <laughs> <laughs> yes, it is. <laughs> come, come. And baby step. Yes, like this. Very good. Great. Now we'll turn around slowly and now you'll put this leg first. This leg first. Yes. Okay, you're comfortable? I'm comfortable. Okay. This is the scar of Phyllis we operated about a week back. Is one week? Yeah, it is, is it one? I was operated on 22nd. All right, so it's, ten, it's more than 10 days now. Yeah, it is more than 10 yeah, days. Yes, it's 11 days yes. and Phyllis has come for our second follow-up and you can see the scar. This is our typical MIS technique, just four finger scar. And there, there's no bleeding as such. There's slight swelling, but how painful it is, Phyllis? Not very painful. Not very painful. No, no. So it's very... Uh, peaceful looking uh, scar so I don't think we need any further dressings okay. this is the last dressing we are doing and after five days you can just take it off okay. oh uh, I take it off myself yes okay that's it okay. so we are with Phyllis and she came to us uh, about 10 days back and we operated her left hip we replaced the left hip by MIS technique <coughs> Phyllis yes. your opinion about the surgery mm -hmm. the services in our hospital our staff so what do you want to say? Uh, I would say the, the surgery was good because mm -hmm. I could be able to walk almost immediately, immediately. the following day. Okay. And uh, from the previous experiences from other people, mm -hmm. I think mine was, I, I don't want to say but it was so good. Okay. Thank <laughs> because you. Because other people have always said that after hip replacement, you can't be able to walk after a week. Mm -hmm. Or you have to sit on a special chair, mm -hmm. you have to sleep on a special bed, mm -hmm. or even a special toilet. Mm -hmm. But for mine, I think it was it was good because there's nothing special that I really needed to do extra yes. than the normal. All right. Yes. And the facilities in our hospital the are they up to the mark? The, it is so clean and so wonderful. The food was very nice. <laughs> <laughs> Great. Yeah. Right. And uh, the, the, the staff are very, very friendly. So overall the experience here was? Overall the experience was good. good. I, I can't say anything that I saw that was need to be improved. No, not any that I... But, still, but still we want to improve. 
maybe you should improve but i don't know where you should improve but, all right uh, thank you uh, that, that is the biggest compliment actually that you cannot find a fault yes, so great yes, yes. so this is the beauty of mis technique that we use for hip replacement okay. that you don't need to be as you said nothing extra yes. nothing special needs to be done yes you feel just like a normal patient yes True. so that is the idea mm -hmm. so that there should be not severe pain after the surgery there might be some discomfort as you notice first day yes. but after that the pain goes down sharply okay. and your mobility starts from day one yes so that is the target mm -hmm. and uh, going forward mm -hmm. after few months mm -hmm. you'll be able to do almost everything in case you want to sit on the floor you want to squat you are on allowed to do you are allowed to do that after three months after three months yeah even squatting even squatting okay so you can do everything you want to ride a bike you want to do anything that you want to do okay you can do that but that is after three months after three months because we want the tissue to heal properly okay okay any questions that you have <clears throat> anything that you want to ask okay the only thing i can ask i, I don't know whether i'll need any other follow-up when i go back to kenya uh if you can come after say six months back here back here so that we can have a fresh x-ray so that I can see how you're doing. Okay. And just to have a cup of coffee with us. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> right? Yes, I, I think I can. Yeah. Great. I, we'll be very thankful. We, we do a review and uh, see how yes, it is. Yes. yes. We want to see again once, only once. Only once. After that, mm -hmm. only one, every year one x-ray, get it done there and they send it to us. Okay. So that we can see it when we can compare that everything is going fine. Okay. Not that we are expecting anything going bad, mm -hmm. but still we just want to keep a watch. Okay. The scenario of hip replacement that we are doing is we are changing it. Like the concept that you had, that it's a long process and it's a long follow up and yes. it's a painful process. It's not like that. So with MIS technique, mm -hmm. that is minimal invasive surgery, mm -hmm. we are changing that concept. Okay. So our Asian patient, African patient, and even some patients from Middle East and all these places, they are coming mm -hmm. just for the same reason okay. that we are doing it by MIS. And it was an honor that you came all the way. Yeah, it was not in vain. It was good. <laughs> Thank you. Thank I have you no much. regrets at all. And I can go giving a good testimony. All. Thank you. Thank you very much. Yes. And we wish you all the best for your future. Okay. Thank and you. And please keep in touch. I will keep in touch. Thank you. Thank you. Yes.